Right now at 6, a local tie to missing University of Virginia student Hannah Graham is revealed as the frantic search to find answers intensifies. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jennifer Edwards in tonight for Philip Coleman. It's been just over one week since Hannah Graham was last seen. As search efforts continue in Virginia, the world is learning more and more about the 18-year-old, including ties she had to Tuscaloosa. Just total shock. Habitat Tuscaloosa Executive Director Ellen Potts says she was at a loss for words when she learned of Hannah Graham's disappearance. And then to find out that, that she had actually been in Tuscaloosa, it's a, a strange coincidence. Um, and, and just makes it all the more tragic that, that she was such a wonderful, giving young lady um, and that, that she is missing. Hannah was a part of the University of Virginia's alternative spring break program. In March, the group traveled to Tuscaloosa to volunteer with Habitat for Humanity. Potts says during her week here, Hannah worked on the house at 20 Juanita Drive. She helped with flooring and preparing the yard for landscaping. The fact that she spent her money trying to um, you know, pay for herself to come here and do good, I think speaks for the kind of person that uh, she is. Charlottesville, Virginia police say Hannah was last seen on surveillance video September 13th, walking in front of Jesse Matthew. Matthew is a person of interest in the case. Authorities are currently searching for him. He is wanted for two counts of reckless driving. Potts says she's keeping those close to Hannah in her thoughts as they go through this difficult time. I have a daughter who just went off to college for her freshman year myself, and um, the thought of this as a parent, you know, just, just makes my skin crawl. So, you know, our, our prayers and, you know, best wishes are with her family and friends uh, for her safe return. A $50,000 reward is being offered for any information leading to Graham's whereabouts.